hello guys this is the second part of candy crush game app and here we will implement the codes into our candy crush game to know that user swiped in which directions using android gesture detector you can see when we swipe in any one of the direction the candies exchanges its positions so for that first of all close this and go to the android studio and here we have to create a new java class name it as on swipe listener and it will implement on touch listener and now we have to press alt enter and implement this method and now we have to create a variable of gesture detector and here we have to return gesture detector dot on touch event and here we have to pass event and now we have to create constructor on swipe listener and here we have to pass an argument that is context and here we will initialize the gesture detector equals new gesture detector and here we have to pass the context and object of our new java class so first of all this comment this and now we have to create a new java class inner java class private final class gesture listener it will extend gesture detector dot simple on gesture listener and here we have to create public static final int swipe threshold 100 and also public static final int swipe velocity that let's say also it is 100 you can change it and now press ctrl o and override and method on down and here we have to add true and again control o this on fling method and now here we have to create a boolean variable for result that is if it is swiped or not and float y difference equals e2 dot get y and minus e1 dot get y and also x difference for our mouse movement here we have to use get x minus get y and if math dot absolute value of x difference is greater than math dot absolute value of y difference it means that we are either going to left or right that is in horizontal direction means in x direction now if math dot absolute value of x difference is greater than swipe threshold and also math dot absolute value of velocity in x direction if it is greater than swipe threshold velocity it means it is swiped and now we have to check in which direction either in left or right it is swiped so we will check if x difference is greater than 0 that means it is swiped right 
and now we have to create four methods for left swipe right swipe and top and down swipe and we will call this method Oops. we will call this method here that is on swipe right because the final exposition of the finger is greater than the initial exposition of the finger that's why difference of x is positive and hence we are swiped to the right and in else condition x is negative that means final exposition of finger is less than the final initial exposition of the finger and that's why we are swiped to the left and the same thing will be applied to the bottom and top positions and also if it is swiped then we will store the result as true and we will return here as result and now in else condition else if copy this and paste it here just change it to y difference and this to velocity y and just copy this code and here we have to paste in this condition and change this to y difference and now if the final y position of the finger is less than the initial y position of the finger that means it is swiped top and for bottom it is different reverse and so for this here we have to call on swipe bottom and here we have to call on swipe top and now we can create its object here we have to uncomment it and now here we can create the object of gesture listener and now go to the main activity and here we will first create a list of image view to store the all image views into it let's say candy equals new array list and then here we have to call for loop image view each image view from candy and in the create pod method we have to add all the image view into the candy and now we can set on swipe listener on all of the image views from candy image view dot set on touch listener and here we have to call the object of on swipe listener and here we will pass context this and then start curly braces and end curly braces and press ctrl o select all these methods that we have created in on swipe touch listener and now we have done now we can check using the toast message to know that in which direction we have swiped just change these messages from left to bottom and all of them with their respective directions and also we can remove this yellow line warning can press alt enter and enter for suppressing the warning now run the app you can see when we will move down up anything this will show the toast message thanks for watching please subscribe to the channel